All right. Is America splitting into two distinct classes, the elites and the regular folks? Conservative writer and commentator Ron Miller is the author of this book. It's called Sellout, and he's the executive director of Regular Folks United. He says the split has already happened. Uh, welcome, Ron. Thank you for having me. All right. Uh, you said it's already happened, and you even have an example. For example, it was the Speaker of the House making this statement on March 9th. Listen. We have to pass the bill so that you can uh, find out what is in it away from the fog of the controversy. Oh, really? A massive health care reform? We just got to pass it and then we'll tell you what's in it? What do you read into that? I read into that that they don't think we're capable of taking legislation, looking at it. In fact, I would say that we probably did more examination of it than the people in Congress. Uh, they talk down to us. They look at us as if we uh, need their guidance and we can't make it in the world without them. Or if we don't know what's going on, so we're just going to be easily duped. Here's another example. Uh, president Obama, when he was Senator Obama trying to be president, said this quote on April 6, 2008. It's not surprising, then, that they get bitter. They cling to their guns or religion or antipathy to people who aren't like them or anti-immigrant sentiment or anti-trade sentiment as a way to explain their frustrations. That is Senator Obama. He didn't know he was caught on tape. That was a fundraiser, but it revealed what he thinks of middle America. Absolutely. We saw this trend back in 2008 when we established Regular Folks United, this condescension, this arrogance that they have toward people that don't share their view of the world. And in that particular instance, he's talking about things that we're clinging to when the fact is we are into our guns and religion and into the rule of law because of liberty and because we respect our Constitution. It has nothing to do with bitterness or clinging to anything. And race is not involved uh, for almost everybody that I know. Legitimate security concern is when it comes to the immigration. That's where the, the Minutemen came up. They decided we're going to watch the border because the government won't. Congressman right. Pete Stark, when asked about this, had this to say about the Minutemen. And then men want to have something to say? <laughs> yep. What are you, what, who are you going to kill today? Oh, yeah. Uh, that's respectful, <laughs> isn't it? What's your take on that? Well, it just shows that people have forgotten the positional relationship between the folks in government and the people that they're supposed to be governing. We're in charge. We're supposed to be the ones that are dictating to them, not them to us. They've forgotten about that. And it's pretty right. apparent. Uh, this isn't the America that I fought for. It's not the values that I believed in when I was a veteran. And as far as I can tell, gotcha. you can see with people and their reactions that they're tired of it. They're not going to stand for it. All right, uh, Ron, thanks so much for sharing your views. Uh, and you are the Executive Director of Regular Folks United. Good luck with the book. Thank you very much.